Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Miss Lauren Lee 11 and today I'm going to be showing you, as you can tell by the title, my Cherry Lola treatment update. So the last Cherry Lola treatment I've done was sometime last year, so maybe close to nine months to a year now, but it was a while ago. So therefore it is time for another treatment and I'm going to show you how I've done this today. Now I've got my mixture ready and I'm going to leave the description of how to make the mixture down below in the description box. But for now I have the mixture. It contains liquid amino acids, baking soda, as well as full fat yogurt. So I'm going to apply it to my dry hair guys and just watch and enjoy it. Okay guys, before I continue, the reason why I need this treatment done is because it's specifically good for getting rid of frizzy webbing at the root. What I mean by webbing, if you're, if you're unaware of that term, it's when you get a lot of hair connected between the roots. Like these bits, I mean, this isn't so extreme, but usually when I'm washing my hair, it's more evident. As I said, my hair is overdue for this treatment and I'm just gonna go ahead and apply it now. Okay guys, so now it's applied. I'm just gonna pin my hair up like this for about half an hour, 20 minutes to half an hour. No longer, you don't need it any longer because it starts working straight away. So once my hair is rinsed, I will come back to you. All right, so as I said guys, this stuff is very messy, if I haven't said that, but I'm telling you now. This stuff is very messy, so you have to have a towel on guys, because I've got a lot of splashes on me and on the floor. Uh, see what you think of the results. Okay guys, so I'm back. I've left the Cherry Lola in treatment in my hair for 30 minutes, and now it's time to rinse it out. So before I rinse it out, I just want to quickly show you my hair feels quite heavy and saturated. So this is the thing about low porosity hair. It does take a while for products to absorb into the hair and the Cherry Lola treatment actually assists with that. And this is one of the things that absorbs nicely into my hair. So yep, it's done its job. As you can see my hair separate into the roots. Okay. Yep, so individual strands. Okay, so I'm gonna go rock, as I said, wash this out, guys. And what I'm gonna be using to wash this out is my cleansing shampoo that I showed you, well, it's a cleansing rinse type of thing that I showed you from Palmer's Natural Fusions. And the reason why I'm using a clarifying shampoo is because I don't want any remnants of the baking soda left in my hair. I don't want my hair to dry and it's got little salty bits of baking soda in there. So I'm going to use the clarifying shampoo to rinse my hair and then style as usual. Okay guys, so carry on watching. Okay guys, so one more thing. If you can see, my hair looks pretty weighed down. So that's what it does. It kind of relaxes the hair in a sense, um, weighs the hair down, but it doesn't actually straighten your curls to the point where, look at that, did you see that? 
does actually straighten the curls to the point where they're actually relaxed and they no longer bounce back. They do come back once you apply product into your hair. But as I said, you can see my hair is elongated and it's not just because the product is heavy on my hair. Once I've washed my hair, it will remain this length. Okay guys, so I'm back, there you have it. Half my makeup is washed off. But that is it. I've washed my hair now. As I said, my hair remains pretty much the same length. Um, tangles, pretty much non-existent. I have to keep condition my hair because I did use a clarifying shampoo. And if you have come across a clarifying shampoo, it does need to have a conditioner in afterwards because your hair gets that squeaky clean feeling, but then your hair feels very stripped. So you've got to put that moisture back into your hair. That's why my hair is looking a bit, bit, I don't know, <laughs> a bit like it could need a condition. Right, so guys, what I'm gonna do next for next week's video, for Monday's video, I'm going to be doing a clay treatment with a twist. So guys, obviously this will be a continuation video and I'm going to do the clay treatment in my hair now, but you'll have to wait till Monday to see it. So if you do want to see the results of that clay treatment with a twist, don't forget to subscribe now, hit the notification bell. And if you did like this video, go ahead and click like also. Much appreciated guys. All right guys, so that is it. This is the Cherry Lola treatment on my hair. My hair's elongated. The full results won't show until Monday. Well, today for me, but Monday for you. So as I said, guys, click the notification bell so you don't have to miss that video. All right, guys, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.